Hi, I'm David Hamburger, back with the next installment of my True Fire blog. And today we're going to be checking out a lick inspired by the playing of tenor saxophonist Danley Turrentine. This lick goes over the middle four bars of a blues in F with a swing eighths feel and jazz blues changes. So we're going to be going from the four back to the one, and then down to the six, and finally landing on the two. Here's what it sounds like. Here it is again. Okay, so we're going from B flat F and then down to D7 and finally resolving on G minor, which is the beginning of the 2 5 turnaround of the jazz blues. So we start out with a pickup into B flat 7 with the fifth flat 7 and root of B flat 7. Then we're into some, we're back to F, and we're basically playing with an F major 7 sound, which is very common to playing uh, when you're playing over the jazz blues changes like this, and we play, and that's in terms of F, the 5th, major 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. And at this point, the chord have, chords have gone to D7, so this is really the beginning of playing over the D7. With the, in terms of D, we've got the 5th, 4th, and 3rd, and then the 5th, flat 7, flat 9, root, flat 7, so... That's all D7 with a flat 9, it's one altered D7 sound. And then we're on to, that resolves to G minor. So we have, which is basically arpeggiating the G minor 7 chord. 2 to flat 3, 5, flat 7, up to 9. So B flat 7. D7 altered, G minor 7. That's the whole lick. Let's hear how it sounds again with the track. Okay, that's the whole thing. Um, one of the things that's interesting is how you could look at the F major 7 sound. It overlaps a lot with the A minor 7 sound. And since A minor 7 turns this D7 into a 2-5, you could think of this as being all A minor 7 as opposed to F major. But kind of neither here nor there. The fact is those sounds are kind of synonymous and they overlap, so it doesn't really matter how you think of them because you end up with the same result. Anyway, it's kind of interesting. So that's this week's lick. For True Fire, I'm David Hamburger. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.